Hey everyone, it's Garrison here and welcome back to the channel and today I'm so excited because now we're moving on to Julie of Kiss of Life and her solo song titled Kitty Cat. Now last time around of course we checked out Countdown, the solo song by Belle and then prior to that we had Sugar Coat by Natty. Both amazing songs showcasing both of their uh, vocal abilities and vocal colors in their own ways. Two complete different uh, songs that utilize different genres, of course, and I'm sure that's going to be the case with Julie here. And I'm assuming that we're going to get a good amount of rap from her because from what I know, she is the leader and the rapper of this group. I absolutely loved her duet challenge for sugarcoat with natty if you guys haven't seen that on instagram and of course tiktok be sure to do so and even their challenge with secret numbers Ginny and minji for a uh, secret numbers song Elksa. but aside from uh that i want to hear what's up with kitty cat here so without further ado let's just dive into the music video now all right so brought it up here julie of kiss of life and her solo song titled kitty cat we actually got English captions up and all readily available, so I, I'm excited to see how the lyrics play out for this one too. So let's go. Everybody say ooh. ooh. So this is Everybody 19 plus rating on it. Yogi Jogi say my name. Love this. Percussive thumping that's going on. Bit of like cowbell work. The charisma, I love it. Gloomy bass. Bit of shakers. She's at some party. The attitude, but I love the subtleness of this song. But what's dynamic is Julie herself with the delivery of her lines. Okay. Whoa, wow, the song switched up. Looking at you and tilting. Oh wow. You know, it's not like the crazy chorus to it by any means, but it does the job. We just go. We just ride. Whoa. We just we just go. We just the free spiritness that we're getting from Julie. We just go. We just ride. We just go. We just some risers. We just go. We just claps. Kick drum snare work. I love the ad libs that's done by her. Hmm. You know what I'm trying to sort of like connect here is all these storylines that we're getting from all the members so far in their music videos, right? You can like truly see that 
points of like youthfulness when you're young um, and you want to do what you want to do uh, at the end of the day uh, and or of course experience new things and um, next thing you know there are these audition you know posters that they uh, took uh, and they're gonna end up somehow I feel like meeting up with each other you know this time around I believe we didn't get fireworks this time which we got in Belle's music video and Natty's music video but focusing more so on the overall soundscape which I love to tend to do and lyrics especially in my reaction and review videos that I do on my channel here I really love the sounds overall soundscape of this hip-hop influence I would say like early mid 2000s to it very uh, simple beat but there's a bit of added nuances and especially that switch up in verse 2 changed things a lot and really upped the ante per se and made me enjoy the song even more so pretty much what I'm trying to say here is I love the song like as it progressed you know just as it prolonged and it, it built up right the one thing is what I've noticed is I just feel like the dramatic scenes and the acting as much as I do like those kind of uh, scenes and how it adds to it I feel like it I really want to you know focus on one thing or other for personally for me I only could focus on one thing or other which is why I go through a second watch and listen for their solos here and uh, one of the reasons why the other reason why is to really hone in and to focus on either the vocal work and of course the the rap by Julie that I'm gonna have to focus on too during verse uh, two so see you know what I'm saying here you know uh Natty she came through a sugar coat and gave us 90s R&B full-blown nostalgia in that one and showcased a lot of her vocal a range and ability and skill set in her song but then Belle I feel like we got a lot of her flavor and her voice and vocal color within her song and now moving on to Julie's solo here I feel like we're getting her super duper charismatic side like I can already tell she's such a charismatic rapper and she's very free-spirited alone said alone let alone you know just based on this solo uh, and on the overall soundscape and how she projects herself you feel me so that's what i really like about these solo mvs and songs is just like we get to know like how's the skill set like how's the vocal color how's the their voices are uh like in their own songs and then once they bring it all together I can't even imagine how that's gonna go we only can wait and find out of course but let me bring up kitty cat by Julie here again and let me point out moments that I really adored hone in on moments that I really want to focus upon and all everybody say ooh, everybody say yeah I guess the story that I am getting here is like partying, going crazy with it. But then on the other end, like before she did take that audition page and there's this bit of like on the fence of like, should I go for the audition or not? And she loves, she was like performing in front of, you know, the people at the party and all, but then was scared to do so or said, stop looking at I me. Mean, it didn't really get. Uh, what was the intentions of that but maybe I'm correct on that end of like oh being on the fence of like being a performer being an artist you know I'm uh, saying just that stage fright or something notice the cowbell work you know the bouncy bass that's going on I love it I love it so much and just very percussive with it she like eases us in and all there's, there's a bit of like airy vocal background vocal moments in this song some brass work I feel like Julie could be a huge bias wrecker for me 
They're like rap skills, very sharp cut. And I love when she raps, like it's very distinct, you know what I'm saying? It's very clear. It's nothing like uh, muddy or foggy at all, you know what I'm saying? Very clear and distinct with it, the, the delivery. So that's what I'm getting, you know what I'm saying? Come closer, don't come. That's me with some eye. Like, I want some distance, you know what I'm saying? And what I liked about this line here, hidden in subtlety vibe. Subtlety is pretty much, this is the definition of subtlety. This song is very subtle with it, but even though it's subtle and it's simple in terms of the production, there's a little bit of like hip hop influence that takes it up a notch and does things differently, like that adds that added nuance that I was talking about. And then it allows us to focus on Julie's uh, rap. And how she projects herself throughout the song, which is really dope. Just that attitude, you know, I love that attitude, the subtlety in this song. But this is what I like, you know, keep a distance from me. And I like how she's moving away because it's getting too crazy whatever's going on here even the earlier scenes were crazy with it wow she just goes straight hard on the paint here in this this verse too put your hands in the air i love how she prepares us Wow. Love the rhyme scheme going on. Yeah, and then I just want to move on here. Man, I can't wait to stream all these solo songs, honestly, on like my Spotify and all, you know, all the streaming platforms and all. The city resembles me very how should i uh say lively right lively outgoing i'm not your kitty kitty cat to uh play with you know i'm just doing my thing i'm going my own way right we just go we just ride we just blow yeah a bunch of that uh percussive uh a good amount of percussion work drum kit work and all bunch of claps bit of shakers you know what i'm saying with the percussion work but at the end of the day I can't wait for all the members to be all in one place together rather than these random people in the mix in their lives, you know what I'm saying? For the sort of storyline that's going on and everything that's playing out, of course. So, man oh man, just the grabbing of the poster uh, to... Yeah, Kiss of Life, they are surprising me with their solo songs, and I'm sure they're going to continue to surprise me into their debut together. It's going to be huge, everyone. Mark your calendars. Spread the word, because I just feel like this group is getting slept upon, and I feel like it shouldn't be, because literally the members' profiles are stacked, and the talent is truly shown. Their skill sets, most importantly, are being shown, and their true colors i can't emphasize that enough so uh yeah i feel like even though upon first listen it was growing in terms of my personal liking to the song as it progressed and all throughout the mv but i feel like with more listens on my own time 
I'm going to love it even more. So there's going to be a good amount of longevity uh, similarly to the other solos I've got to say. So uh, take care as always. Be sure to like, subscribe as it goes a long way and helps out the channel so, so much. This warns my connecting with y'all in the comment section down below in regards to Kiss of Life's Julie and her solo song, Kitty Cat. Man, what a charismatic a rapper and I'm sure her leadership is going to be shown uh, once we get to know the members even more. But yeah, take care as always and peace.